<laughs> Now are Sue. It's unbelievable to think that we're actually here in June of 2021. Um, if somebody would have told me that a regular goofy looking guy like me would be standing across from someone as gorgeous, sweet, loving and supportive as you. There's not a chance in the world that I would have believed them. Um, I'm going to keep this short because I know yours is probably way too long. <laughs> um, we've talked about this day for so long. I remember sitting on the couch at your parents' house way too early on in our relationship, already talking about where we wanted this to go. I can't believe we're actually here. At first, the conversation started as kind of a joke. But deep down, I know we both knew exactly what we wanted. From the beginning, every part of our relationship has been so intentional. We've dated intentionally, and neither of us were going to settle for anything less. Because of that, we're here today, standing across each other as best friends, ready to commit to each other for the rest of our lives. From the first car ride, where we spent three hours without a moment of silence, um, to sitting on the living room floor until 3 a.m., having one of the most vulnerable and transparent conversations together. From the first time I tried kissing you and you turned your head away. <laughs> <laughs> to the hours we spent outside on walks, long car rides, deep conversations, and endless tropical smoothie. I've loved every single moment I've never been so happy in my life. I've never had so much fun with someone else. Uh, you're my best friend, my biggest supporter, constant source of happiness, fun, and positivity. The most beautiful soon-to-be wife, and the reason I wake up happy every morning, most mornings. <laughs> I promise to always love you unconditionally, to make sure your happiness is my first priority push you further in your faith and grow closer to God as a couple. I promise to always value your thoughts and opinions, to always make sure we're never going to bed angry with each other, and to always make sure that you know you're loved. I promise to always lead us in a way that will please God and glorify Him in every action that we take. And lastly, I promise to always be your best friend and an, over, an overflowing source of love and joy for you. I love you forever, Mallory Sue. Michael Steven, I can't believe this day is here. And so now I get to call you my husband. It is the biggest blessing of my lifetime. In the last year and a half, we fell in love, started a YouTube channel, got engaged, moved to a new town, started new jobs, endured long distance, planned a wedding, and so much more. We fit a whole lot of life into that year and a half. And that makes me so excited to see what we'll do with our lifetime. It seems like just yesterday you were picking me up to go on that first three hour car ride. <laughs> I swear then in there, my Swanee, we'd be here someday. Our love seemed to start the second I walked out of the house to you. And it's been a peaceful, gradual, easy, yet intentional climb upward together with God ever since. I want you to know, I want to thank you for dating me so intentionally and making it so easy to see your care for me from the beginning. It's easy for everyone to see the godly, strong, protective man you are, but you're so much more than that. I knew you pay attention to the details when you pulled a sticky note out of your wallet with my go-to Starbucks order on it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you take care of what you have when I saw you dust off your Legos with a tiny paintbrush for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were my best friend when you had to leave days at a time for the academy and it literally felt like part of me was missing. And I knew you were the one a long time ago. <laughs> We've already grown through so much together. And we continue to intentionally choose each other every day. I promise that as we grow and evolve into who God created us to be, I will still intentionally choose you, no matter the circumstance. We promise to put Jesus first and to be the strong woman of God I need to be in order to be the wife I need to be for you. We promise to lovingly serve you every day, 
make you endless PB and J's, <laughs> and even wax your car with you every once in a while. When arguments or bad days come around, I promise to be quick to apologize and forgive, and remember that we're on the same team. I promise that everything we go through will only bring us closer, make us stronger, and more in love than before. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to actively pursue you every day, and to always remember how blessed I am to call you my husband. So for as much as Michael and Mallory have consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed the same before God in this company and have pledged their vows to each other and have declared by this declared the same by giving and receiving of rings, by the authority vested in me as a minister of the gospel and in accordance with the word of God, I now pronounce him husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man separate. Michael, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me tremendous pleasure to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Michael Olson.